Hello world! Welcome to my cooking show, the inauguration of Cooking with Maestro. I am your host, Chef Nové. As many of you know, I am a composer, music director, and conductor. My passion for music equates my love of food and cooking. Today, here in my home kitchen in Los Angeles, I'm going to make one of my favorite dishes, crab cakes. Here are the ingredients. Add a pound of crab meat. Using spoon, add all the ingredients. and mix all together. Once all the ingredients are all incorporated, it's time for us to cover it up with either plastic wrap or silicone cover. And we need to refrigerate this for 20 minutes. At this time, we will set the oven temperature to 500 Fahrenheit or 260 Celsius. Before the fun part begins, let's coat our pan with olive oil and then we're going to start molding the crab cake with different kinds of rings. The circle one, the big one and the square one, whatever works for you. This is my favorite part because I can be able to mold anything I want and to make sure that you don't press it too hard so much pressure so that all the crab cakes can come out really lumpy and also you have the option of molding it onto your hands like this we can even use a square one You can be, be really highly creative when doing this. All right, that looks perfect. Then we can use also a big ring. Mmm, this smells so good. I'm sure it will come out really, really fantastic. Now I've finished molding all of these. Now it's time to bake it just to make sure that your oven is set to 500 degrees. This may take between eight to 10 minutes. It depends on your oven, of course. And if you want to add a little crispier to your crab cakes, um, you can add a minute or two and you can smell the aroma when it's done. Here's our remoulade sauce. Try mixing it all together now. You can eat crab cakes in different ways. You can either eat it without um, the sauce or plainly squeeze a lemon juice. Salt. Pepper. Mmm, it looks really yummy. It's time to take out our crab cakes. They look delicious. Now it's time to decorate our plate. This is my favorite part because you can be really very creative. So what I have here 
as uh, edible flowers and our famous sauce, remoulade. Okay. And we can use also a little brush to spread them apart like this, like painting. And then time to put the crab cakes on our plate. Let's see a square. And another round. And voila, here is our crab cakes. Now it's time to taste it. Look at my new gadget. This is my favorite gadget. Look how beautiful. This is a Sauvignon Blanc. I believe this is really a good match for our crab cakes today because it's very light, crispy, and very aromatic. Mmm. Perfecto. Joining me in tasting crab cake is a very good friend of mine, John Schweitgard. And not only he is a food critique, he's also a foodie and a cinematographer from Hollywood. And he's here today with us. Actually, he's here because he's doing the filming for us. Mm -hmm. So welcome to the show, John. Thank you very much, Nove. So what, tell me what you think of this crab cake. So I'm, I'm excited, to I've do, been smelling it. It smells so good. I'm gonna join you in. I know it's gonna be really good because I created this, but it's always to freshen up and taste. What do you think? You get everything, the herbs come through very well. Yeah, let me try the get a little sauce on there. But I just love the texture is what I'm really getting. You got the crispy outside and the soft and juicy inside. And I just wanna pick it up and eat it with my hand yeah. now, but <laughs> And it really, really smells so good. It's fantastic. Mm. I, I love it. I, th well, I think you did a great job. Well, very good. Thank you so much. I know it's going to be really fantastic because I created it. <laughs> but let me try it again. Mmm. Mm. Really delicious. Perfect for the summertime here in La La Land. And it's perfect for a, a good glass of Sauvignon Blanc. And how is it pairing yeah. with a beer? I chose a, a Pilsner beer because it's kind of like light and crisp and it just matches well with something like that. It's nice and fresh and zesty, lemony. So this doesn't overpower it too much. It's a pretty clean palate, so. So cheers. Cheers. Delicious. I'm gonna keep eating so because good. it's really, really good. Come Thank on, John. <laughs> Let's do it. I hope this crab cake brings comfort to your hot summer days here in California. Thanks for joining me in the inaugural episode of Cooking with Maestro. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the button below, and cheers!